Hello, welcome to this week's Toddler Time. I've got a couple of songs to start with. We'll do the first one that we did last week, the counting song. Ready? One, two, three, Jesus loves me. One, two, Jesus loves you. Three, four, he loves you more than you've ever been loved before. Five, six, seven, we're going to heaven. Eight, nine, Jesus is kind. Nine, ten, it's time to end, but there's time to sing it again. One, two, three, Jesus loves me. One, two, Jesus loves you. Three, four, he loves you more than you've ever been loved before. Five, six, seven, we're going to heaven. Eight, nine, Jesus is kind. Nine, ten, it's time to end. There's no time to sing it again. Now I'm going to teach you another simple song that many children like, like who I've worked with and taught it before. It goes like this. Allelu, 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 alleluia. Praise ye the Lord. Allelu, 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 alleluia, praise ye the Lord. That's the first section. And then the second section is praise ye the Lord, alleluia, praise ye the Lord, alleluia, praise ye the Lord, alleluia, praise ye the Lord. And you can sing the alleluia standing up and the praise ye the Lord sitting down. So if you'd like to join in with me and copy me we'll have a go at that allelu 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 alleluia praise ye the lord allelu 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 alleluia praise ye the lord praise ye the lord alleluia praise ye the lord alleluia praise ye the lord alleluia praise ye the lord and you can spit it into two groups or two teams someone can do the alleluias and someone can do the praise ye the lords and when you sing you stand when you're not singing you sit i'll sing it through and i'll stand and sit but i'll sing both times but if you'd like to go in teams if one of you does the alleluia one of you does the praise ye the lords let's try that Allelu, 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 alleluia, praise ye the Lord. Allelu, 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 alleluia, praise ye the Lord. Praise ye the Lord, alleluia, praise ye the Lord, alleluia, praise ye the Lord, alleluia, praise ye the Lord. Okay, now you can do it really quickly, so let's try that like that for the last time. One, two, three. Allelu, 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 alleluia. Praise ye the Lord. Allelu, 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 alleluia. Praise ye the Lord. Praise ye the Lord. Alleluia. Praise ye the Lord. Alleluia. Praise ye the Lord. Alleluia. Praise ye the Lord. Well, I hope you enjoyed that. Now it's time for our story, which is about Jonah and the big fish. One day, Jonah was enjoying a lovely snooze. It was a wonderful snooze when he heard God speaking to him. Listen, wake up, Jonah. I've got a very important job for you. Oh, what's that? said Jonah, yawning. Please take a message to the people of Nineveh. Nineveh, said Jonah. I'm not going to that horrible place. All the people there are baddies. I know said God sadly. That's why I want you to go to them. So Jonah packed his bag and set off in the wrong direction. Nineveh was that way, but Jonah went that way towards the sea. He was running away from God. Oh dear. Do you think you can do that? Not really, because God is everywhere. Anyway, when Jonah reached the seaside, he found a ship and got on board just to get away from God. He he he, God won't find me, said Jonah. Bye bye. And he got onto the ship. The sailors pulled up the anchor with a loud heave ho. You might want to help me do that. Heave ho. One more time. Heave ho. 
Jonah oh, oh, yawned and fell asleep in the cabin below. Come on, everyone, while Jonah's asleep, let's help the sailors row the boat out to sea. Row, row, row the boat gently out to sea. Jonah's trying to hide from God, but we'll see, we'll see. Sing it with me. Row, row, row your boat gently out to sea. Jonah's trying to hide from God, but we'll see, we'll see. Do you think Jonah, God could see Jonah on the boat? Yes, he could. Of course he could. And he wasn't very pleased with Jonah. I'll show that rascal, said God. And he blew upon the water. The waves built up and crashed upon the deck of the ship. The sailors were very frightened. Ah! They shouted, our boat will be ruined. God must be cross with us or with someone. Who is it? Jonah said bravely, I think it's me. I have up upset the God of land and the sea. So throw me over the side with a one, two, three. And so that's what they did. Ready, everybody? Throw Jonah overboard. One, two, three. And Jonah splashed into the sea and began to sink. He sank down to the bottom of the sea. Now, Jonah was very sorry that he'd ever jumped aboard the boat. And he cried out to God in a frightened voice. Can you hear me, Lord? There are bubbles up my nose and there is seaweed in my toes. Glug, 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 pull out the plug. Please come and rescue me. Do you think God could hear Jonah at the bottom of the sea? Yes, he could. He did hear Jonah call and he sent a big fish to swallow Jonah and all the seaweed as well. Gulp, the fish swallowed him. Jonah went slipping and sliding like a mouthful of jelly from the mouth of the big fish down right down to his belly. Then, with Jonah safely inside, the whale swished his tail and off he went. Jonah said from inside the big fish, Oh God, what a wonderful God you are. You heard me pray and I promise from now on, I'll do what you say. So God told the whale, or big fish, to swim to the land. The whale did that and gave a <gasps> hiccup and spat Jonah out onto the sand. Now then, said God, to Nineveh, off you go. And do you know, this time Jonah went right away. Hooray! And do you know what? The people of Nineveh were glad that Jonah went because he told them about God's love and they stopped their bad behaviour and turned and began to live good lives. I'm going to finish with a prayer, this story. Dear God, how wonderful you are. When I'm praying, you listen. When I'm asleep, you watch over me. Everywhere I go in the whole wide world, you are there to care for me. Thank you, God. Amen. Now I have one little song that I've kind of partly wrote myself and it's really what the story of Jonah teaches us. The fact that God is everywhere. He's always with us. It goes like this. You are with me everywhere I go. You are with me everywhere I go. You are with me everywhere I go. Then it goes like this. The chorus bit. If I go all the way down, you're there. If I go all the way up, you're there. If I go to the left, if I go to the right, you are always there. Ready? You are with me everywhere I go. You are with me everywhere I go. You are with me everywhere I go. If I go all the way down, you're there. If I go all the way up, you're there. If I go to the left, if I go to the right, you are always there. Well, I hope you like that little song and I hope you like the story. And it's great to see you all. But I'm going to go now and we'll do another Toddler's Time story and songs next week. Bye. Bye.